Hello everyone, and welcome back to Completely Average Gaming, and welcome back to uh, Planet Coaster. Uh, today we're going to be starting a brand new park in celebration of the 1.8 update, as well as the World's Fair update. And uh, this park is definitely going to be having more um, specific inspiration points in around the world uh, that you can that I can refer to, and you can have like a look at what I've based things upon. Uh, keep in mind though that I am uh, not perfect at this, so things will not necessarily look exactly as they do in the picture. Not even close, probably. However, um, today we're basically going to be primarily focusing on the um, entrance area, the entrance building. I haven't been playing around with the DLC or the update yet, so it will all be new to me as well, so there's probably going to be some fiddling around. Uh, and we're going to be tying this park into the park we have over in um, at the Vintage Park Pack Pack Park. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, the, the understand those who can still need a name for that one. If you have a name for that one, be sure to fling that in the um, comment section. And uh, without further ado, let's just get cracking, shall we?
the uh, the time lapse there um, unfortunately some of the footage for this episode got uh, corrupted and um, is currently not available <laughs> um, but um, at least what we did see was uh, hopefully worth it uh, some of it was of course done uh, in the corrupted files uh, so uh, so the plan is here that you come in uh, over this way you come in uh, by car or bus uh, this is the VIP parking I'm planning on um, possibly putting a larger parking over this way um, and then uh, you can also take the buses uh, or you can come by mo monorail. The monorail just goes in a loop um, in the mountainside here and comes back in here uh, at the, and that's just to have it going so that it can move around and look alive. Uh, the station is far 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 from done. Uh, this side here is somewhat done. Um, this still needs a little bit work on, uh, let's say here, for example, um, and maybe also make the whole, if I can just get that away, make the whole, right now it's very, very naked, very no colors, apart from this one railing, of course, um, and, uh, and the trees and such up there. Um, we'll see about that in, in the future, though. Um, and also co cover up the stairways. Um, and for this one, the the path also needs to be uh, redone. Uh, as for the park itself, it's very empty at the moment. Um, there, there will be stuff here, there will be stuff here, in order to cover up the fact that there's nothing there. <laughs> uh, the plan here is that you buy your tickets right here, and then you move on to uh, the, um, the actual entrance. Um, and this is the glorious logo that we got going on. It says it stands for Brightwood, um, which was the best name I could come up with. If you have a better suggestion, um, you know, go ahead and play that in the comment section. Um, I I'm not even sure I'm too fond of the logo itself as of right now. As this is going to be sort of a world, more of a world fair kind of park. I figured it was uh, nice to have a globe as well in that logo. Um, anything I didn't mention, didn't touch upon? Uh, the um, bus stop here is, of course, the same as the one that is in um, in um, the Vintage Park, um, Vintage Pack Park. There we go. Uh, so that's where that came from. Uh, other than that, everything is built from scratch. Some of these pieces are new, of course. Um, these ones, those, um, these right here as well. Uh, what is really annoying is that 
you can you can hold F in order to make the trees go into place. However, it's not really aligned, so it ends up like this. Apparently, I didn't see that until after I had done it. So, um, uh, and I did I did try to like fiddle with it, um, but then I thought I fixed it, but I didn't. Uh, but but I'll I'll go over that and fix that at some point. Uh, if you have any suggestions, any comments, any thoughts, be sure to leave that down below in the comment section. And if you haven't already and you watched this far, why not put a subscription on it? Um, and I'll hopefully see you all in the next one. Till then, cheerio.